Tìm hiệp số xa công xa chết thay mà càng càng về thế Better English with Matthew Robinson Chẳng đăng thà nơi mê riêng ní Tục Matthew còn năng lượng do gặp vấy mập hay nạn tượng ổ khả ní Chịp xếp tại tôn thân năng cần lưu Chịp chung mùi nâng cao bằng trên xâm lên xem xem hoặc đài Vẫn ta cũng phải like, comment, nâng xe phê kèm FTV Đảm bây tựa tổ bàn này về lò lò Nhưng chẳng có bao đồng trăm dưới 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 The first thing we'll do today is to look at the English alphabet. And as you probably know, the English alphabet consists of five vowels and 21 consonants. Okay. So let's quickly look at the 21 consonants. Okay. Consonants are hard sounds. You have to use your uh, lips and your tongue and I think your throat to make them sound properly. Yeah. yeah. So for example, H. H. You see, you're using yes. the whole of your mouth to say yes. H. Or Q. Yes, Q. Or T. T. Whereas before, I've explained about vowels. With a vowel like A, you only bring it from your lungs. Yeah. A. Yes. And today, we're going to look at only the first 11 consonants. And here they are. Next program, we'll look at the other ten. Now, the first thing you need to know is that the consonants all have names. But the names are not what they sound like. So let me name these 11 consonants for you. Yes. B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M and N. Yes. But they don't sound like that, Paul May. Yes. They sound B, S, D, F, G and so on. Yeah. And to help you and the viewers at home, I've chosen 11 simple words to illustrate each of the consonants. At least I, I, I hope they're simple. I think they're simple. Let's have a look. So, why don't you try each one of those and I will shut my eyes and listen. Okay. Boy, Cow, Dog, Fish, Girl, Here, Jam, Jam, King, Lock, Mineta Chasau, Men, Mineta Bora, No, Mineta Te. Very good. Do you know the one word I was really proud of you? What is that? Fish. Fish. Yes, yes. you learned there. That was excellent. <laughs> yeah. Now, I did ask you if you could prepare uh, alternative words for each of those 11 consonants. Did you do that? Yes, of course. Oh. Do you want to see? She's, she, she does everything I ask. So, very, yeah. very <laughs> so, yes, I'd like to hear your words that fit those 11 consonants. Okay. And I'm going to shut my eyes and listen. And if I don't understand one, I'll stop you. Yes, okay. Okay, so you can see that 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 you with the car, Mineta land. D, with the door, Mineta three. I've got to stop you. I didn't understand B. B, B is the kmum. Oh, B, yeah. B. Yeah. I love bzz, bzz, B. Yes, yes, yeah. Oh, one yeah. of those. Yeah, okay. Kmum. Yeah, okay. Got it. Right. <laughs> okay, let's okay. continue. Fish, with the fly, Mineta sat la at Girl, 
with the goal mẹ này thả cổ đá here with the heart mẹ này thả đập lứ j with the cha mẹ này thả cổ lỗ mm -hmm. king with the key mẹ này thả sáo l with the look mẹ này thả mớ m with the make mẹ này thả bóng cát n with the nose mẹ này thả cho đó mò Pretty good, but I didn't quite get the M. Um, it's the make. 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 Ah, yeah. M-A-K-E. Yeah. Make. Uh, oh, and help me, what is the Khmer word for that? It's a bongkat. Bongkat. Yes, okay. bongkat. Okay. To, uh, to make something. So we are making good English, are we here? Yes, yeah, of okay. course. You've done well on the uh, first 11 English consonants. Yes. Did you find that difficult or quite easy or what? It's easy. Easy? Yeah. Oh, let's just wait till the last 10. See yeah. if you think it's easy. They're a little bit more difficult. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> mm. So now let's move on to the um, one word with some English expressions. Okay, chắc như rằng từ mình mình to tiếp tới to thành English expression chắc đang thay ngày nít gọi lực dọc nơi bịa vây mà thôi chỉ English expression. And the last word we used was young. Yes. So what do you think I might have chosen for this week's word? Must be opposite from the young, right? Mm, Must be old, right? Yes, yes, you bet. <laughs> yes. How much do you bet? Um, eighty percent. Eighty percent. Yeah, well, you're right. So let's have a look at old. Okay, well the first thing is I want you to say old properly. Could you please say old? Old. Yes. yes. I want to hear that D. Old. 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 Yes. Let's yes. get that right first. Yes. <laughs> okay. So here are some expressions. Yes. The first one is old school. Old school. What do you think it means? Um, like an old song or something. What, you mean like a, literally like an old school? You yeah, mean? Like no. It's kind of old song, it's no, called old school. No, yeah. not really. It's actually a group of people who think in a certain old-fashioned way. Okay. But you don't have to be old to be old school. You could be a, for example, a young teacher who thinks in an old school way. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. The next expression I want to tell you is tough as old boots. So what does it mean? Okay. It means very strong. Mm -hmm. Very, very strong indeed. And very tough also. Tough and strong, yes. very strong and clang So Bome, it can apply both to things and to people. So for example, you might go to a restaurant and you get a steak. Yes. And it's quite difficult to cut. Mm -hmm. And you'd say, Oh, this steak is as tough as old boots. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Um, and you could also have a soldier mm. who's coming back from a war somewhere, mm. Mm. and he comes back and he's strong and he's walking around, and people would say, Oh, look at that soldier, he's as tough as old boots. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and the reason is because boots, not that my boots are old, but boots that are old and have lasted a long time, they are usually tough. Yes. Yes. Mm. Okay. Yes. The next expression with old is as old as the hills. It means that it's very old, right? Mm. Yes. But why? Maybe the hill. The hill is a... The, the what? The hill. How many hill? hills? Thank you. Yes. It's a easily to break down. Yeah. Do you mean this, right? Yeah, well, uh, yeah, yeah. no. 
hills are very old because they've been there for a long time. Mm -hmm. So you can say something is as old as the hills. For example, you could say your grandfather is yeah. as old as the hills. Yeah. Chẳng tiền nông phong này cứ miền này thà very old, chẳng miền tén, ô thì họ đôi chia grandpa, lục tá, quạt chả chẳng. Vậy ai phải thà grand my grandpa is as old as the hills. And another example, you could have a tourist going to Angkor Wat, and the tourist says to the guide, "How old is Angkor Wat?" The guide could say, "Oh." As old as the hills. Và sang chỉ biết như tôi nói câu vật ở từ lịch sử câu vật chẳng hay coi cái số thà ta sẽ câu vật năng ở dụng của mạng chín năm hai chẳng nẹt đại nộp đá năng còn ai trả lời thà as old as the hills ban để sao ta vì miền ở dụng quay trong nào mà hay. And before we go on to the last one, please, 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 one hill, two hills, three hills, one. Here. Yes. yes. <laughs> Don't forget those S's. <laughs> yes. Mm, I'll okay. Box you. <laughs> okay. You can read the last one because I've read the first three. You okay. can read it. Okay. Thank you, Anna. Can you tell me the same old story? So I don't know about this. You don't know what that means? Yes. Okay. So somebody tells you a story about, let's say, their grandma mm -hmm. being a wonderful woman, mm -hmm. and you can say. Please don't bore me anymore. It's the same old story. Oh yes. Chẳng mình đây tha ở đi con lỗ từ hôm mình chẳng quạt bên dây lục dây mình nhẹ đài quạt chìa mình đục sợi ách cha bàn tay quạt dây hướng nâng là hột là hột đó kê thôi nhì chẳng nên nữa. And you could say, Oh, I'm so unhappy. I never have enough money. I never have enough anything. I haven't got a new iPhone. And somebody else says, Oh, it's the same old story. lưu tới tao nó nâng ở ô thì hầu mới tiết mình đi tham mình mình nhẹ nâng con là ô hồi nay ở lôi thời gian này thời gian này là hầu bật tay con dưới nâng con dưới tay 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 chẳng dừng cái phiền phở phiền nâng bàn này. So you can see old is used in many different English expressions. Yes, chẳng dừng ở riêng bàn English expression bàn chờ nên người mình chạy. Probably because English is an old language. Yeah. Okay, so now let's move to more common words, and these will be 321 to 340. Yes. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Are you ready? <laughs> I'm ready. One, two, three. Okay. Leave. Leave. Mình đây thà trả chánh. Song. Song. Mình đây thà bọt chùm riêng. Measure. Measure. Mình đây thà bố. Door. Door. Mình đây thà thuyê. Product. Product. Mình đây thà bà lạ tập hòa. Black. Black. Mình đây thà khó mấu. Short. Short. Mình đây thà tiếp. Numeral. Numeral. Mình đây thà lệch. Class. Class. Mình đây thà thân ảnh riên. Wind. Wind. Mình đây thà khó chó. Question. Question. Mình đây thà xóm nua. Happen. Happen. Mình đây thà cả lãng. Complete. Complete. Mình đây thà bình lĩnh. Ship. Ship. Mình đây thà cặp bà. Area. Area. Mình đây thà đầm bắn. Half. Half. Mình đây thà bẹ cận đá. Rock. Rock. Mình đây thà thầm mô. Order. Order. Mình đây thà tam lục đá. Fire. Fire. Mình đây thà phá lớn. South. South. Mình đây thà khăn thầm bồn. South. 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 Yes. Okay, that was pretty good. Mm -hmm. I would say out of the 20 words, you said 16 really well, but mm -hmm. you're still not sounding the ends of those English words. Not yeah. all of them anyway. Yeah, it's hard for me because of my tongue. What's wrong with your tongue? I don't know, you, like South. You want to see a doctor? No, uh. but it's hard for me to pronounce like, uh. like South. <laughs> Easy for me. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, see? Sir. Together? Sir. Ah, very good. Okay. So now, Bome, I've chosen four words and I want you to make a sentence including those four words. Okay. And the words are leave, wind, area, and fire. Okay. And once again, I'm going to shut my eyes and listen. Okay. Okay. So the first one is the wind 
makes me leave the area of the burning fire. Yeah, that's good. Okay, 85-90%. You're getting better and better. Yeah. Now, your turn to choose four words. Okay, I will choose song, black, short and class. Song, black, short and class. Yes. Okay, I'm okay. looking forward to it. Okay, thank you for coming you. I wear short black pants yes. to class while listening to a song on my phone. So you do. And what do the uh, boys say when you wear your short black pants? They say that, too short. <laughs> <laughs> what does the teacher say? They said, detention. <laughs> oh, keep you in the class, yes. But at least you have your phone. Yeah. yeah good, okay, very good. And uh, as usual, some of those words have more than one meaning. In fact, from the 20 words, there are five this week. Let's see the five. Okay. The first one is leave, trả tránh, to leave from anywhere. To leave from somewhere. Yeah. Okay. Can you think of another meaning of leave? Um, how about take leave? Take leave, like yeah. holiday. Yeah. Yes, good. Uh, right? Yes, it's yeah. fine. That's two. Okay. That's two. Yeah, yeah, she's doing well. She's doing well. Big clap. Good. Okay. Okay. So the next word is? Okay. Class. 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 Or low class people. High class is a popular they got real man kung po, jia mean tanak, eight bag nonchet down to my low class, jia manu die, got a real man sub bantra, rumu got chop real no pain and moja down. It's not very kind to call people low class yeah. or high class, but we know what we mean. Yes. Jung Tomada, bit a high class, high low class nicker, but some young jet can at the day between a papa, a cap and good play chat and junk, but some jet tom glad that now work on ye come ye lodge. It's a good thing most people are middle class. Yeah. They're in the middle. Like yes. I think you and me, we are middle class. Yes. 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 Yeah, okay. yes. <laughs> right, and the next one is order. Order. Bantia. To order someone to do something. Yes. Yes, Mineta Bantia. And another one is. I don't know. <laughs> well, you can put things in order. For mm -hmm. example, if I take my papers, mm -hmm. they might be in the wrong order. It might be page five, three, two, okay, one. Yeah. So I would need to rearrange them to put them in the right order. Okay. There are more, but we haven't got time to do them all. Yes. <laughs> so the fourth word is fire. Fire, minute a plume. Can you and think of another meaning? No, I, I think about plume only. Really? Yeah. And another one is? H have you never been fired from a job? Oh, never. Do you know what it means? Sacked? I'm it's getting mean, this. It's meant to fire someone? Yes. From the job, right? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, but don't worry, I'm not going to fire you. Thank you so much. And you're not going to fire me. So we're okay. Yeah. Two meetings there. Middle That's class. <laughs> yeah, if, if you fired me or I fired you, we wouldn't have a class. Mm, no. Yeah. no okay. And you can say the last word. The ship. Another one is? Well, there's the meaning of ship, which is boat. A boat. Mm -hmm. Yes, a That's boat. a noun. Mm -hmm. And then there is ship, which is a verb. Yeah. And that means to carry something from somewhere to somewhere else. Okay. Jang pia kapa na yom jay mai nang kue chip pia tha ship chen liem hay nang ship mui tiet dai min nai chai kai ya sap min nai tha ka dak tum ning pia kan lai mui ta kan lai mui tiet. Now there's one particularly interesting word in those twenty that we looked at. Yes. Min pia mui tiet. And one of your words was wind. Wind. Which wind. Wind. Yes. Yes. Which means. Yes. Yeah. Wind. Yeah. Yes. But if you pronounce it differently, you get the word wind. But it is a meaning or not? Well, you know, you know what? What is this? This is a. It's a, a watch. A watch. Yes. And in Khmer, it is a... Okay. Yes. And when you do that, you mm -hmm. wind it. 
à yes 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 ok nhưng chẳng bị môi tiết cái hơi thao vàng mình lấy thao ca bụng vờ là ca chạp bụng vờ là về thao vàng yes and here I've explained how you pronounce it differently when it's the wind i n yes when it's wind it's i n e i n e yes that sounds like wine yes sara sara ah yeah. wine wine yeah, do you like wine yes of course red or red white red wine red yeah. wine okay <laughs> sara krahom ja sara krahom oh my god wow. so good yeah. that's good okay good <laughs> so now The last thing we'll do in the English class today is yes. to look at a new word for you. Yeah. So maybe it's not a new word for you, but you can see how other words grow out of it. I wonder if she can guess what word it's going to be. No. You can't. Have no clue. It begins with A. A, like angry. <laughs> yeah, it could be angry, but no, I'm not angry. Okay, let's have a look at it. It is. Appet. Appet. Appetite. Appetite. Yeah. Appetite. <laughs> I have no better say. I said it wrong. <laughs> Now, do you know what it means? Appetite. Appetite. Mm. It's mean like hungry. Yeah, it does. It well, yes, it sort of means hungry. Yes. Yeah. But let's get the pronunciation right. Appetite. Appetite. Good. Yeah. You, you actually did sound the T. Appetite. 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 Yes. Yes. Uh, and it means that you have a hunger for something. Okay. Trong biệt thà appetite, mình lấy thà cá khliên ở vậy mua vậy yes. And bố mẹ, in English it usually applies to food, mm -hmm. but it doesn't always have to apply to food. It can apply to other things as well. You might have an appetite for work. Okay. Chẳng biết thà appetite này nhưng mình mà sầm đói tới lơ một mà hôm mà ha nâng ta mà một cái nhưng ai sầm đói tới lơ cả thưa bữa mua xem xem có bạn này đi chưa appetite for work mình đang dương sải khen chẳng thưa cả. Now appetite is a noun, um, as you can see. Yes. But out of that noun, we can get an adjective. Yes. Appetizing. Appetizing. Yes, so something can be appetizing. Okay. That dish of food looks appetizing. Okay. Mm. It look good. Mm. Okay. Tasty. Yeah. Oh, it look tasty. Yes, yes, and it makes you hungry. Yes. Yeah. 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 Just for you, I've done you a special sentence, including the word appetizing. Yes, you have. Yes, it's here. Please show me. The wedding food looks so appetizing. Yes, that's good. Yeah. Now say it very clearly to uh, the audience. Okay, thank you, Anna. To nothing. Oh, can you hang on? You have to bow your head to the madong. The wedding food looks so appetizing. Minh này thế, mà hộp cà ní mới tới cô ở trong nhầm. Yes, you yeah. got appetizing absolutely correct. You could slightly improve wedding and food. Wedding and food. Yes, yes. two Ds. Wedding, food. Wedding, food. Wedding, food. Wedding, food. Perfect. That's very good. So appetizing is the adjective, but we can easily change it into an adverb. Okay, trong việc thà appetizing vì mình tâm ta chỉ niêm vì mình tâm ta chỉ con là niêm ở lớn thì việc bồng lành không ta chỉ ăn vợ mùi thiệt. And it's very easy for me. Mm -hmm. All we have to do is to add an ly. Gonna be appetizingly. Oh, listen to her. Say <laughs> it again. Because that no sound sir and sir and something is hard for me to say. So this is the easy one. Oh, it's, yes, so good. I want to hear it again. Appetizingly. Yes. Yeah. Again, again, again. That's fine. But now let's look at a sentence that includes the word. Appetizingly. But the, but the meaning is the same like appetizing, right? No, it's the adverb. So it is describing a verb, not okay. a noun. Okay. Yeah. In jang biet tha appetizingly nang kue tiet tong tan nang khai tha describe rip rap om pi kai jat sap chamu mat ti ti quat ai u ti ho pa yong yom chamu yong bo chen ki yang nang. And here is your sentence. The wedding food was appetizingly laid out on the table. Ma hop ka ni. Cô vậy trong nhà nó là bây giờ đã mà lơ lửa tọc. Yeah. Is that right? I think so. I understood tọc anyway. Table. Yeah. Tọc. Yeah. Yeah. Could you say the sentence slowly and clearly? Okay. 
the wedding food was appetizingly laid out on the table. Yeah, that's that's good. Yes. That's good. And you understand no problem. No problem. And you think everybody at home will understand the difference between appetizing yes. and appetizingly, yes? Yes. Cho nên ông ấy vô là bỏ vô cho comment khang khom, chẳng reply comment. Now bố mẹ no I always like to test you on opposites. Yes. Chẳng còn ông thưa cả tệ nhóm cho mùi nông biệt nay tôi bị biệt khang lớn đi. And I wonder if she's going to know the opposite of Appetizing. Okay, so I should take a guess, right? I'm not looking at the screen. <laughs> so it will be an appetizing. Say right? it slowly. An appetizing. Perfect. Let's check. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's all very well yeah. going. It's all very well doing this like <laughs> football fans, but now I want you to actually make a sentence using the word unappetizing. Okay. Chẳng nhận mong thưa các bậc cao tuổi dục mỗi đã tăng thêm năng bị unappetizing đi. Chẳng nhận được cái này cũng phải bậc cao tuổi dục mới nhom. Out of your head. Okay. Okay. So my sentence is the food look nice but it was unappetizing. Oh yeah, that that's good. That's that's, good. that's that's very good English. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. Congratulations. But now, let's just get the pronunciation from 95 to 99 percent. Yeah, okay. congratulations to me again. <laughs> <laughs> the food looked good. No, looked good, yes. But it was unappetizing. Yeah. Yes, good. Okay. okay. Good sentence. Well Thank done. You. Thank you. <laughs> and that's my English for today. Yeah. Um, and I'll be back soon. I hope with you to do some more better English. ចាអញ្ចឹងការព្រៀនភាសាអង់គ្លេសត្រូវបានបញ្ចប់ក្រុមតែទំនេះប៉ុន្តែអត់ទាន់ចាប់ទេគឺនៅមកវគ្គទ